Hey guys, I'm Ren Dwinnell. I'm from Lincoln East. Allegedly! And my poem is titled, Butterfly Effect. A high school freshman. The phrase sounds much better than an awkward 14 or 15 year old kid that everyone older than them hates for their behavior and the volume at which their voice rests. I am a freshman. I am not nearly as loud as my friends as you can already tell that's saying something. <laughs> I am older than I am, more understanding than that jerk senior is, spent the first couple months of high school in grief. I am more grown up than my 19-year-old brother is. A high school junior, a nice way of saying a teenager who couldn't care less about what language they use when talking to other people and what kind of, you know, how they appear in social interaction. A high school junior, think for a moment. A freshman girl dating a junior. Think for a moment, who are they? You question their motives, don't you? Think for a minute, who is he? You, you already don't like him, he's disrespectful. Wears clothes you should be able to afford, spends money he shouldn't have, and the things she doesn't need. What's the only logical reason a junior would date her? But that thought would be incorrect. I hate to prove people wrong, but that's fantastically incorrect. He's not your traditional junior. He was, he is, quiet, and not just audibly, but you couldn't hear his soul as loudly this is foreign to me, that a person this confident could be so at peace. I am so confident because I first was not. I forced it upon myself. I am aggressive. He is at peace. In social situations, seemingly always, I can barely describe him. He sees brighter lights and colors than I, though he wears sunglasses. Are we all just red-green colorblind? And when he tells me I'm beautiful, I can, almost believe, I can almost immediately believe him because lying has to be forced into the vocabulary of a guy with a few shared traits of my brother. And he's up there a little ways in the clouds, but I can still hear him. Maybe she was just a little too short, maybe a little too short with him. Maybe she saw his silence as an awkward no and not a thought she couldn't hear. Maybe she couldn't understand his indirectness. Maybe she couldn't understand that all he needed was understanding. Maybe she couldn't see that her jealousy was blinding her from a friendly interaction that he didn't understand would make her leave, and I could see my brother. In his eyes, I spot a youthful innocence, a childish playfulness, but his friends egg cars. He is older than I am, but he and my brother are like elephants. They forget little but love a lot, and little mistakes matter not to him. He steps over them. I pick apart the ground and worry that that rock is misplaced, but he can pull me away and convince me that not everything I do will cause the butterfly effect. I am older than I am, more worried than I should be. He is older than I am, but not really. <laughs>